a bonfire burns next to the church in one of Belgrade's suburbs. Hundreds of locals came to either attend the church service, to light candles for the living and deceased, or to burn branches of oak trees called badnyak. Putting those on the fire has a deep symbolism for the Serbian Orthodox Christians, as it is regarded that the sparks of its flames mark Christ's birth. Christmas is considered a family holiday here, and families prepare a special no-animal products dinner for Christmas Eve. 33-year-old Mina spent the whole day in the kitchen preparing various local delicacies. For me, Christmas is more a symbol of tradition than a religion. It means a family reunion, love, happiness and, of course, food. Her nine-year-old daughter, Tonya, was also helping by preparing traditional winter apple compote with the dry plums. At the same time, in one of Belgrade's busiest markets, people were buying badnyak branches and making last-minute purchases for Christmas feasts. The Christmas customs and the Christmas date vary between the Orthodox countries. In time, some decided to follow the Gregorian calendar, which puts them on the same timeline as the rest of the Christian world. Serbia, though, is still holding to its tradition. And remembering the tradition is something that is passed here from one generation to another. Even with the little things, like how the Christmas bread was made last year. Mama has said a lot of it also. Mum was sitting here last year. I remember that. And I remember that Mum and I arranged a bread. We put on top of it some flowers and leaves and birds. Christmas bread is another local uniqueness. A coin is put inside a dough before it's baked. On Christmas Eve, the bread is equally divided yeah. among the members of the household, and the one who finds it should expect a lot of luck for the entire year. Aljoša Milenković, CGTN, Belgrade.